Daschle should still be appointed? I'm beginning to think not. It really depends because we all know that a tax return is really complicated, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't file his own tax returns. We need somebody with his qualifications, and whatever he may have done with some tax problems is nothing to me. If the president has faith in him doing the job and, you know, making our health care system better, then I think that's a good appointment. If you can't do your own taxes or if you own taxes, how are you going to relate to the common man? Do you think President Obama is sticking to his policy of holding high ethical standards in his administration? Rhetorically, yes, but, you know, the proof's in the pudding and too many exceptions. I think it's too early to tell, really. I mean, it's just, he's just been in office for a couple of weeks. Well, if he keeps nominating people like this, you begin to wonder. Like any president, he's going to run into stumbling blocks and he's going to get criticized for it. There's no doubt about it. Should nominees for government offices with tax problems be excluded from their offices despite their qualifications? No. Like Emphatically no, because we, we're human and uh, we all make mistakes. I do think that people, if they seem like they're evading their taxes, should absolutely be disqualified. I think you have to ask them a lot of questions, and I hope senators do. Well, I mean, if they can't operate you know, their own taxes, right, then I don't think they should hold public office. If I don't have a problem with a guy, I'll say, okay, well, you know, everybody's human and they'll learn from it. But if I don't like the guy, you know, it's like, ah.